Hey there YouTube, it's me, Nerdo 732 and today I'm going to show you how to make a Lego traffic light. So the pieces you're going to need are 1 1 by 10 plates, this um, 1 by 1 transparent tile, 6 of these 1 by 1 transparent plate plate round uh, you're gonna need three different colors you're gonna need two green two red and two yellow okay nine of these cylinder pieces one by one cylinders all right and four of this one by one with the stud on the front. Um, make sure three are yellow and one is try to make it like light gray, the same as your cylinder. I your yeah light gray. I didn't, so I just made it black. I just had black, so I'm just gonna use a black. So and a nice big plate. Well. A plate or a base plate so you can build it on because once you build it up higher it starts to get on the stable so that's why you have the plate so you can place it on right so now we're gonna build okay we're gonna start off first move all these pieces off and you're gonna take your big your Play your uh, stand where you're gonna hold it. Make sure it's big. I'm using a base plate. <coughs> mm, sorry. I put it in the middle since this wasn't evenly in the middle, so I just put that there. Okay, you're gonna take two cylinders and you're gonna place it on. You're gonna stack them. Okay. On your base. And now you're gonna take your little your gray one or a black if you don't have a gray. All right, you place it and then you place it right there like that. You take your one by one tile, transparent. All right, it's gonna be your the push button for pedestrians. And now you're gonna take your rest of your cylinders and. You're just going to stack them on top of that piece, okay? So you're going to stack on top all of them. Eh. Oopsie. There. So once you have all that done, you can do the next step once I get there. So reason why this is why I need, needed the base because otherwise without it it kind of falls well it stands on its own but once you put the big tile the one by t then you're gonna take your one by ten and you're gonna place it on top so that's why when you need your base because as you can see tips and if you do a short base it's gonna take the bit base with it. That's why I said recommend a base plate or a big t plate. Okay. Now you're going to take your tra these and then you're going to stack them. Okay. And then you're going to put the lights on. Okay. You're going to first do the front. Put red. Yellow and green, and then you're gonna flip it over and you're gonna place it on the back. Red at the top, so that way, this is like a two way. It's best to do it with two hands. Oh, 
this came off. Okay. And now you can take your red and then you're going to place it on the back. See? So it should look like this. T stud on the back. Same thing for your yellow and green. Yellow may look may look hard to see to yellow for traffic. And and there you have it. There you go. There's your traffic light there's your traffic light piece. And you basically just put it on and then you put it on. On whoa. Make sure this side, the stud side is facing front. You place it right at the end, and there you have it. Here's your traffic light, and then you can hang it over. Tra you can make it over traffic, and place it just like that. All right, there you have it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. I'll try to subscribe back. And comment if you, and if you have any um, ideas that you would like to b see built, you can post in the comment box below, or you can go to my channel and post in the comment on my channel, or send me a message. And then I'll try to do it, and I'll give you a shout out because you recommended, you wanted to see me try it, so I'll give you a shout. I'll give you a shout out because you rec you recommended for me to do it. All right, so thanks for watching, Naruto one seven three two. Same bye.